Oh, hello. I just want to make a quick video just talking about my favourite tennis player, Maria Sharapova. I just watched uh, on TV a match in the Australian Open 2016 quarterfinals between her and Serena Williams. Um, uh, it was a very a tense and exciting match to watch, and uh, one thing I really took away from it, the result was um, Serena Williams, I think she won the first set 6-4 and the second set 6-1, so the scoreline looks like that, but when you watch the match you could just see how much, how tight it was between the two of them, um, although Serena was just incredible, like she's a really awesome player, um, but what I really like is, um, I think Maria Sharapova, people have been saying that she's lost to Serena Williams, like, 17 or 18 times in a row and um you know I was like uh I was hopeful that she would win but really it doesn't matter to me like I when I follow a tennis player I just want them to like try the best their best that they can do and put everything out there and when when you watch this match she really did and actually the commentator even mentioned it at the end as well which was like really really cool um yeah because when I support someone I just want them to just give their best because you know people can't win every single thing so um, I really, really, really admire uh, Maria Sharapova in this match. Like she, she gave everything she could, but you could just see like I don't know. There was like lots of um, yeah, I don't know, like m not mind games, but kind of like you know, there's a mental battle going on, you know, between these players when they're out there. But yeah, I really admire. Like if you watch the very last game of the the match, like I think Maria Sharapova even had like break points. Like she fought back to get some break points and stuff like that. And I was really, really good match, uh, even though Sharapova lost, but still, the way she lost, she was really good, like, even when she was leaving, you know how most tennis players, I mean, they're obviously really disappointed, but, um, she still did a, like, a quick wave to all the people and stuff like that, and before she left, she still signed a few things, which I think was really, really cool. Um, oh, one comment that the commentator said, um, I don't know who the commentator's name was, but she said, um, you can see in these moments, um, not the multi-million dollar face of a company, um, but the nine-year-old girl that came to America with just a thousand dollars, you know, and has had nothing, you know, what do I mean, like, when nothing was guaranteed. I thought that was really cool. So, that's the stuff that I, when I watch stuff like that, it's really, um, I really admire it, and it's very inspirational and stuff like that, so, yeah, that's all I wanted to say. Maria Sharapova's awesome. Uh, I had a really good time watching this Australian Open. I, I watched Maria Sharapova play, um, a couple of times. For, you know, this time around, and saw her practice and stuff as well, and met other Sharapova fans, which is really, really cool. So that's all I wanted to say. Hopefully she has, continues to have an awesome career and everything like that.